what's going on y'all so I'm sitting in the uh, line for Amazon Flex it's uh, 10 12 I can check in in three minutes my block is uh, 10 30 to 2 30 four hours seventy two dollars today is my first day there was no security guard to check in I just uh, decided to be a sheep and follow the line so I uh, picked up my packages and it's my very first day I went with the uh, not organizing uh, way of doing things I've got 39 packages it's gonna take me 33 minutes just to get to my first one they're all out in Shepherdsville it's a uh, learning experience today I'm gonna try to do this as quick as possible even though I didn't organize nothing but everybody there was all lining their boxes up organizing everything but I just went gung-ho through them scanned them threw them in the box or in the car and I was done I didn't even count my boxes I probably fucking should have but I'm gonna wing it the first time because I'm a rookie and uh, we'll see how it goes this ought to be fun <laughs> hopefully I don't have any problems and all packages are I'm able to deliver them because I really don't want to drive back to the warehouse because it's on the complete opposite end of where I'm going and another opposite end of where I live so hopefully uh, this all works out all right I have uh, two packages left it's been pretty smooth I mean it's like 102 the two packages are two streets next door to me so I've got like uh, what is it 230 so I got like an hour and a half left and I'm pretty much done I mean this was easy peasy I'm Turn right happy. on links of Dogwood Boulevard super easy uh, you couldn't ask for anything easier I know I keep saying easy so the uh, my first day of Amazon Flex is complete and it was pretty simple the GPS is kind of wonky but it works um, I started using Google Maps at first but then the uh, GPS is pretty accurate there was times where when I get to the customers house the uh, I've arrived button hadn't shown up so I'm walking around like an idiot and then I get back in my car and drive a circle or back up and pull back and then finally it'll say it'll give me the option to, to select you've arrived which is kind of annoying and then there's times where I take a picture I hit done I get in my car and I look at it and it wants me to take a fucking picture so after that I take a picture I hit done I look at my phone to make sure it completed and then I move on whoops I'm supposed to turn back there I'm gonna go in here and take a piss maybe get something to drink I'm on my way home uh, I've been holding my pee for a long ass time but everything went well except at the end when I don't know I don't fucking know maybe I should call I don't know it went at ask your little survey question and when I hit submit it just sat there and thought about it, thought about it, thought about it then that the app crashed so I don't know if it cleared out my block or you know marked it as complete I don't fucking know I feel like I should call them but I don't know I think I'm gonna call them but other than that you know the GPS is a little stupid sometimes um, but I didn't have a single problem you know I was done with like an hour and 15 minutes left although I'm way the fuck out in Shepherdsville I need to go home it's like 20 minutes away so I mean, I'm still getting paid I guess yeah I really enjoyed it I didn't have a boss in my ear I didn't have fucking co-workers bitching and whining I didn't uh, have to deal with any of that bullshit but yeah and while I was out my boss sent me a text I don't know what the fuck he's like can you come in today and uh, so we can talk I'm like oh great what's that mean does it mean I'm getting fired I don't know 
I just I can't think of anything that I've done that's a fireable offense. I'm sure there's something though. I'm sure there's a fucking a story that got twisted, you know, all fucked up. I don't know, man. I just it could be nothing. Man. It could be he wants me to set up the driver computer. I don't. But the way I don't know the way the message read is. It's kind of weird. It's got me worried. But, I mean, honestly, I don't give a fuck. Because my plan was to get out of there anyway. If I get out now, I mean, that's going to suck. But if I get fired now, because I, I wanted to wait at least six more months before I quit. Just because I want to get everything in line. But we'll see. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna grab something to eat. Actually, no. I think I'm just gonna go in and talk to him. I told him it'd be like 3 o'clock because my block ended at 2 30. But it's 1 126 now. So, I don't fucking know. I don't even wanna speculate. But I'm kinda nervous though. Because it's. I'll be losing out a lot of money. Easy money. Oh well, as far as Amazon Block. It was it was easy it was far away yeah but once i got to the delivery area it was all bam 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 and i was done it was quick there was a lot of uh backtracking i felt like but i don't know maybe they need to re-figure their their routes the way they run the deliveries the order of them all right, so I called. I called support, and everything was delivered. The, the block closed. Everything is good to go. So that's always a plus. It's my first block. I didn't want to fucking bat crash, and then all of a sudden it's not showing that I delivered everything. So. But yeah, everything was cool, everything was easy, uh, easy money. It was easy, I mean, self-explanatory, you follow the instructions on the app. Everything uh, was easy. <laughs> I need the uh, staples button, that was easy. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah, I'm sure you didn't learn nothing, other than uh, how my day went. Well, well, I'm gonna go to my pizza delivery job and see what they want. I feel like I'm getting fired though. I don't know. It's probably nothing. Oh well.